up y'all this is your girl Renelle AR Love 22 here and I'm basically coming to you today for another out on the day type of um, video um, this is actually going to um, air at the end of the week today is the 14th of October um, I'm gonna do kind of a compilation um, this is actually the first day that I am starting Weight Watchers. Um, I'm actually going to be going to um, my second meeting. The first meeting, I just wanted to kind of just go in and just kind of see um, how it is, like what all they do as far as that goes, um, what is what it's about, um, kind of just hearing about people's success stories. Um, sorry, y'all, I gotta sneeze. I feel like I feel like I had to sneeze um, but yeah so as far as that goes yeah I'm just basically um, coming today to uh, you know go ahead and officially start I am very excited you guys um, like I told you in my last video I've struggled with weight like my whole life and so I'm actually really excited because this is really I really feel like it's going to be something that's going to be life-changing I don't know what like what the feeling is um, I just feel like it's gonna be something different and something that I know that I can more than likely follow through with so um, I'm going to actually do my weigh-ins um, not today I'm gonna do it um, I'm well yeah tomorrow so like like I said this is gonna be kind of a compilation video um, I'm gonna be doing my weigh-ins and I'm going to basically be um, letting y'all kind of you know just go through a normal typical week that is going to be uh, for me um, starting this week um, I'm actually have orientation for my new job tomorrow I'm going up to uh, my new job actually today to do my benefits and my open enrollment for my um, my medical dental as far as that goes as well and um, then I'm going to I actually have my I got my to-do list because I told I told my uh, I told my grandmother that I'm going to uh, get some stuff for the house so um, yeah I have to I'm actually going to head over and get me some gas right now. Then I'm going to do my benefits. Um, then I'm going to go and pay a couple things, go and take care of some stuff. And then I'm going to uh, actually go to Weight Watchers. And so I wanted y'all to just kind of just join me on today just to kind of, you know, just get a, uh, a first-hand look into a typical week that is going to be arising for me. I, I'm going to be getting my schedule this week for my new job. Um... Y'all, I'm so nervous about respiratory. <laughs> um, I mean, I, I'm not like crazy, crazy nervous because it's like I already know like what to expect. I already know uh, what to do, but it's like, you know, things vary from patient to patient. So, um, yeah, I'm just I'm going to be kind of giving y'all a first glance kind of, you know, look into a typical week. Then I have Bible study. I have... Um, I've, I'm, I just joined a new uh, gospel group for uh, my pastor. My pastor is actually the director of it, um, City Gospel Choir. Shout out to y'all. Um, and uh, as far as that goes, yes, this is going to be a busy week for me. So um, let's go ahead and get started. <laughs> actually did not know that it start I mean I knew that it start like 
like classes and like weigh in start at 5 30 but i thought that we can like come earlier like if we want to like speak to people about um you know about the program as far as that goes and you know new coming members as far as that goes thought that they could come and just kind of get a heads up and stuff but actually yeah they start at uh yeah 5 30 p.m today so i'm actually what 30 45 minutes early so um I'd much rather be early than to be uh, not coming at all. So I'm actually just going to uh, wait around for a little bit and just kind of go from there. Um, tried to open the door. Doors are locked. So um, I'm yeah, I'm just gonna wait around and just just uh, wait for someone to come. So yeah, I'll update y'all as soon as I get out. All right. Hey guys, it's me, uh, Renelle Air Love 22. So, um, I just got out of the uh, Weight Watchers meeting, um, and I'm actually now a Weight Watchers member. So, all glory to God. Um, I actually enjoyed every bit of it. It was wonderful. Um, everyone was nice. Um, uh, they have what you call um, leaders for each person. Um, my leader, uh, her name is is Annie. I think. Yeah, Annie. And so she was very nice, very helpful. Um, I'm just going to give you all just kind of a rundown. Um, there's, I think, three. They have a family plan that is, I guess, um, I forgot how much it is, but I think it's like 25 per person and maybe 100 per month. I'm not sure. I'd have to recheck that. So do not mark my word for that. Um, I signed up for the four-week plan, which is $48 a month. Um, and so that is very affordable for me, um, considering everything that I'm getting within the plan. Now, they do have something with the, it's called eTools, that you can um, do with your app. So they'll give you a code once you pay, they'll give you a code to go into the actual app itself and actually um, and actually um, key it in to um, go ahead and uh, use the app itself. And so um, I'm actually, the, the lady forgot to tell me about that, the lady that I actually, that rung me up and everything um, but um, I'm actually going to go tomorrow to get it fixed. Um, and as far as that goes, um, I'm going to show you just a little bit of what I've got. So, and another thing that I like about <laughs> about this is that they actually, um, they, they bring free treats, I guess, every week for people to um, kind of try, whether it be like a new item on the market or just something that someone may have found. Um, maybe in your local grocery store that uh, basically um, that doesn't have as many points as far as that goes. And that's another thing I'm going to get to um, here in just a second. They gave us free Halloween uh, pretzels. Hold on one second. All right, guys. Y'all, I have to get up out of there because I was hearing some doors shut and I didn't hear no, no, uh, no footsteps and I'm like that was weird so 
Yeah, so I ended up getting out of there and I went to another location. Um, I'm outside. I'm sure y'all know, but I'm in my car. So, yeah. So, just to pick up where I left off. Um, the treats, as far as that goes. Um, I guess she said that at Sam's Club, they have like, I guess, like little pretzels. Um, like little packages um, in a big old pumpkin I guess what she was talking about and this is just like a nice little simple snack that you can basically have um, I guess like throughout the day um, I don't it, it's I, I don't know how many like times a person can eat but I mean I know that I'm gonna get into the point system here in just a in just a few but um, you know as long as you um, I guess are within your points you know then you're fine but I'm gonna get into that here in just a second because I don't want to put my foot in my mouth um well I'm putting my foot in my mouth right now for a second um but um yeah so these little snacks are just one smart point um so just letting y'all know so um if y'all do happen to be on Weight Watchers and you want to look for a nice little snack little snack pretzels that are very um very point friendly and you know you want a salty kind of crunchy you have a craving for something salty and crunchy these are good so um, I'll probably eat these here shortly <laughs> um, and so yes I'm gonna go ahead and get into the points um, so on my plan um, because she didn't know that I wanted to do the um, the app itself to track my points to track everything that I'm eating and I will mind you uh, will let let y'all know that you do not have to track um, uh, zero point foods and so I'll get into that here shortly as well so um, my points she gave me a, um, a little booklet that I am to take with me it's this called it's called my success story and so I'm I'm supposed to take this with me um, I go to a meeting once a week and I am to take this with me and basically what it is is it tracks um, my weight loss uh, progress throughout each week itself and it has in it um, basically my enrollment date um, my daily smart point budget um, weekly smart point budget my points my my fit points goal and um, it just talks a little bit, bit about, you know, this is my journey, giving me kind of, I guess, words of encouragement on the front. Um, and has something along the lines of, like, what's my why? So what's my reason for weight loss? And technically, I mean, everyone's reason for weight loss is to not only uh, look better, but to feel better overall. Overall confidence booster. So those are some of my uh, reasons why. Um, and yeah, so, um, as far as that goes, my goals as well. Um, so I told y'all what my goals are. I want to be down some weight. I didn't really specify a specific amount of weight, but I do want to be down some weight before the year is up. So as far as that goes, um, you know, my goals are along the lines of that. Um, and I'm new here. So this is what my leader tracked for me today. So, I'm currently 256 pounds, I will let you all know, um, and my daily point uh, intake that I should be um, intaking, she calculated it for me, and they do have some type of points calculator system that you can buy for $10 that basically um, you can, um, you're supposed to enter in certain information on this calculator and it will um, calculate your, um, like how much something is worth as far as points go. Um, and so my daily intake of my points that I am to consume are 29 points. Now, they do have something called weekly points as far as that goes. And so um, kind of like she was talking about like uh, banking, like um, um, like I guess um, your, like your savings and like subtracting and like withdrawing and uh, you know um, depositing, like deposits and stuff. So basically what this is, um, with my daily intake of smart points, I can only well, I can only consume 29, but not necessarily. I can actually um, go over 
but what it will do is it will I think hold on let me let me get this straight before I say anything out of the way it'll like she'll it'll take it I guess from my weekly it'll take it from my weekly so I'm allowed uh, 42 weekly uh, smart points so what it'll do is it'll take anything that I go over as far as my 29 smart points it'll uh, take it out of my weekly um, allowance of my smart points so I'm allowed 42 so say for instance I went over like uh, four points so 29 30 well, 29 30 31 32 33 so that'll be 33 points that I consumed and so it'll take um, out of this it'll take out of this 42 so um, as far as that goes and it'll have you know whatever's left from that 42 41 40 39 33rd 30, 38 weekly uh, points that I'll have left over for my weekly and so um, as far as that goes you know that's basically what that is and so um, you know not too bad I'm not tripping so um, and then I cannot have anything less than 19 smart points so I guess they specifically like feel like you know if you're consuming anything less than 19 smart points that you're not adequately feeding yourself and so basically I guess what kind of like what starvation mode so you know that's basically that's ba that's basically that so yeah can't go anything less than 19 if I go over 29 I mean I'm okay um, but I still you know they'll they'll take it out of my weekly and so and another thing um, if you do not or like if you consume like less than 29 but you're still over your 19 and like you have like um, like this is me person like this is my amount of points like this does not relate to anyone else because each and every person is different as far as their weight goes it calculates the amount of points that you're supposed to have so I'm just speaking you know directly on me um, about about me so um, like say for instance if I if I'm over my 19 points but I'm less than 29 for the day then um, like say for instance if I have 10 points left over um, then it can only like it'll add points to my weekly and so I cannot like like it'll it'll add it to my weekly, but it'll only add four. Like the the maximum that it'll it'll add is four up to like for my weekly um, smart points. So it'll add four on, on top of my four eighty two. But if I have like maybe like three points where um, I, I still have, it'll add those. But it will not add anything over four smart points uh, to my weekly so that's that um and then so yeah it just has over the next four weeks basically um i'll be bringing this with me and it um it'll hopefully start seeing the uh the scale numbers drop so keep that and so this is my pocket guide that she gave me as well and it has basically just has um my uh, it's a reference list to zero point foods as far as that goes um top tracked foods and fit point values so basically zero point foods um are like um plant-based uh protein like tofu poultry skinless chicken or turkey breast whole ground or whole or ground or cooked in zero smart point sauces or spices seafood uh, fish shellfish fresh frozen or canned fish um, eggs our uh, whole eggs are zero points none uh, fat plain yogurt um, Greek Icelandic unsweetened though um, and plain soy yogurt is good and like of course your fruits and your vegetables are all uh, zero points and like uh, yeah lentils corn um, uh, fresh and frozen fruit without added sugar all of those are zero smart points so yeah not too bad and um, beans as far as I goes lentils yes so yeah and it even gives you like um, top tracked foods and so like say for instance almond milk plain unsweetened in eight, eight ounce um it has all of that on here i'm trying to see it'll it'll give you the amount of points i believe it's what yeah it'll tell you like say for instance like a eight ounce of unsweetened almond milk is only one point so it tells you um what each is worth um the commonly tracked foods how much 
they um, are worth as far as smart points. Um, and they even give us like little recipes and stuff too that I really like. So the the little thing that they gave us this week is apple ginger mini pies and stuff. So I'm really looking forward to trying their recipes. So yeah, ain't too bad. And it has a well uh, welcome to Weight Watchers book. And so basically it just kind of gives you words of encouragement as well things on tips and on how to shift your mindset um, and eat what you love as far as that goes like me y'all personally know I've already told y'all I have a big sweet tooth um, I don't know where I got this sweet tooth from <laughs> but no I, I think I, I think I got it from my grandmother so as far as that goes oh yeah let me let y'all know um, as well too I got a little tracker manual so I can track like what all I'm eating as far as that goes in here now only the food that has uh, point values track it in here any zero point foods you do not need to track but still just being honest like you still need to keep things within moderation just because um, something is zero points don't mean that you need to just go overboard because I mean all of it still adds up so just letting y'all know there for a tip um, but yeah as far as that goes man um, I'm gonna be going once a week um, I feel really good about it. I'm trying to think if there is anything else that I need to say as far as that goes. Um, I really enjoyed myself. Um, they really have a lot of um, really good success stories, uh, you know, I mean, that I've heard today. Um, everyone, we all talked. They, like, each and every person kind of gave me um, their feedback as far as, like, what helped them in the program itself and what not to do and, like, basically, like, how you shouldn't really, you know, sit up here and um, make yourself feel bad for if you do eat out of your points. And, you know, just, like, like don't sit up here and judge yourself. Like, that's basically what they're trying to do. They're trying to get out of that mindset of just, like, judging yourself and, you know, just trying to, you know look at food in a healthier way they're trying to give you your freedom you know while still keeping it in moderation because that's the biggest thing with with myself and a lot of other people you know doing things within moderation no one's saying that you can't sit up here and have something you just need to learn how to practice moderation and a lot of us sadly like we we don't but at the same time that's you know just because you had one day where you messed up does not mean that you know your journey is over or that you just need to just you know just result back to eating negatively you know like everybody has days so you know just keep that in mind and so that's what I'm telling myself all the time and you know I'm gonna keep that in mind and um, I'm actually going to um, um, trying to see I think I'm going to go ahead and just upload this portion of today go ahead and upload this because um, like I feel like the video will kind of be too long if I wait like you know throughout the uh, end of the week I feel like I need to just go ahead and just upload it and then go ahead and upload tomorrow separately because I do have a lot of things going on tomorrow I'll be going to uh, orientation I have gym with my new buddy and my trainer I'm gonna be getting all my measurements and everything I do have to go back up there to Weight Watchers to get them to uh, change my stuff over sorry I got a message change my stuff over to uh, to the uh, the e-tools um, which is just about a dollar more but they do take the money out of your account that's the biggest thing like you can track your stuff like manually but if you want to do it to where like you um, you want to do it on your phone then you would have to pay a dollar more and get the e-tools and it's just it's still 48 a month but they'll just be subtracting that out of your account so you would have to give them account information um, but yeah as far as that goes um, like if y'all have any questions or if any of y'all are on Weight Watchers or anything if y'all have any like advice like to give me um, I'm gonna be 
posting encouragements um, throughout my journey as well to you all as well because we need to help each other this is a community this is a community wide thing and I feel like we all need to get healthy we all need to you know be on one accord when it comes down to our health because too many people are dying nowadays and you know just having you know really crazy health problems that really could be prevented if they would just you know have that encouragement and also you know make the right choices and some don't have that uh, tool or tools or access to be able to um, you know make healthy decisions and you know I feel like if I can help just one person then I'm straight you know I just want to you know in turn help others while I'm helping myself so if we can kind of have that back and forthness I feel like it'll be good so um, as far as that goes I'm signing off y'all um, I will catch y'all in my next video and I will be uploading this tonight so y'all look out for it tonight um or just whenever um but yeah just uh give me some positivity uh encouraging words um leave them down below in the uh, comment section and of course like comment share and subscribe and i will see y'all in my next video bye <laughs>